Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, I've actually got some fairly good news in comparison to yesterday's video. Uh, anyway, uh, today's video is discussing the fact that yesterday, I believe, or the day before now, I can't quite remember, TT Games announced that LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga is complete. With just over a month to its release date, it is now ready to go to shelves, to be available after pre-orders digitally, it's now, it's, it, it is ready to go. Like, the game is now finished. I assume there's just some minor little patches they've got to do, but basically, the game is done. Like, it is now ready to be released to the world for everyone to play. Do I think they'll release a bit early? No, I'm pretty sure they're going to stick to the April the 5th release date. I could be pleasantly surprised and turn out to be wrong, but I have a strange feeling that I won't. But all I know is that now the game is ready to go in just over a month, and I personally cannot wait to play. I can't wait to see what DLCs they launch after the launch, because I believe the seven we know, the seven we know about already are being released at launch. So I assume the remaining 13 that we have rumoured will be coming some point afterwards. Really hoping for a Clone Wars DLC, but you never know. It could happen, it might not. But I'm leaning towards that it probably will. But yeah, Skywalker Saga ready to go. I honestly can't wait because the game is huge. It is looking to be, well no, correction, it will be the biggest LEGO game of all time. So, it's going to be big. 300 playable characters and 500 non-playable characters. So, that's a lot of characters, playable and non-playable alike. And of course we now have the confirmation of different land zo landing zones on different planets. I believe you're able to travel between those landing zones through vehicles, whether that's fast travel or you're actually able to travel manually, I don't know. I'm assuming fast travel. As for planet to planet, that is full on travel. You can man. I, th I think you actually have the option between fast travel or manual travel. I know for me, I will probably using probably be using the manual travel because yeah, I would love to fly an X-Wing across the galaxy myself. I don't want no cutscene to do it for me. I'm gonna do it. And honestly, I just can't wait because there are so many ships in the game that you can pretty much use whatever ship you like. And you can use it with any character you like. For example, in one of the trailers, you can see Boss Nass flying a Y-Wing. Yeah. And we have some details on the random capital ship battles, with the fact that you can actually board them and bring them down from the inside, which is really damn cool. Very much um, some Battlefront 2 vibes going on there, and I can't wait to try that because nothing would make me happier than bringing down an Imperial-class Star Destroyer alone. However, I would like to see um, the option to gain assistance because, you know, Flying an X-Wing versus a massive Star Destroyer is a pretty big task, so I would love an option in the game to request assistance from whoever the enemy of the ship you're fighting is. So like, say if you're fighting a Separatist um, droid-controlled ship, you could get help from the Republic. Or if you're fighting a Resurgence-class Star Destroyer, the Resistance could come and help you. Just something for TT to, th to think about. If they haven't put it in already, which is possible, TT are pretty thorough with features they add to their games, so there's a good chance it's in there already, but if it isn't, you know, TT, if you want to add it, I wouldn't say no. But yeah, that's going to do it for this video, guys, on the fact that the LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga video game is now ready to go, and I can't wait. So, don't forget to like this video, subscribe. To my rock sounds and frosts channels that links are in the description master button is down there yeah that big red one unless you've already subbed then it's great thanks for that by the way and once you've done that don't forget to click all three of our bell icons get all three sets of our notifications comment as well because why not and let me know what film you're most excited to play through in this game i'm curious i'm personally looking forward to revenge of the sith once you've done that too don't forget to follow me on my social medias I'll be going live on stereo tomorrow at 6pm, an hour after this video comes out. Once you've done that too, don't forget to follow Roxanne on her, follow, check out Roxanne's website and Frost's Instagram. 
Balance will be below my link tree in the description, which my links will be in. And lastly, of course, don't forget to share this video with all of your friends so they can join the infinite loop of liking, subscribing, commenting, following, and sharing. And around and around and around that loop. I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. Goodbye.